Well, time is running out for about 100 candidates if they're hoping to derail the runaway train that appears to be the mayoral campaign of Olivia Chow. CP24's Beatrice Vaisman is live for us at City Hall this morning with two new polls telling a very similar story. And it seems like if there is, you know, consistency at this point, it is just with Olivia Chow while the other mm. candidates are kind of moving around. Absolutely, no question about it. You've got that right, Jen. Uh, Olivia Chow has been the consistent front runner in the vast majority of polls. Uh, and then kind of the second, third place, they've been switching it up a little bit, gaining, losing a couple points. And that's what happened here as well. Mark Saunders, the number two contender, according to Forum Research, actually picking up uh, two percentage points since the survey was last conducted uh, back on May 19th, uh, where he had 12% support. This time around, the survey conducted over the weekend. 1,000 people polled. He had 14% support. But really, uh, the front runner is quite clear. Olivia Chow, according to this poll by form, 34% support unchanged uh, from the last from last week. And really, she's been consistent over the course of five weeks now since she first entered the mayoral race back in April. Josh Matlow sitting in third with 12% support. Uh, Mitzi Hunter in fourth with nine, along with Anthony Fury and Anna Bailau, and then Brad Bradford at the bottom. Uh, uh, still also worth mentioning, there's still about a fifth of people, according to this survey, who are undecided. So there's still time for other candidates to start courting their votes, uh, though there is four weeks to go from today for Election Day. So if they're going to start courting votes, it's going to have to happen pretty quickly, Nick and Jen. There's also another survey out today. Uh, this one's from Liaison Strategies. It paints a very similar picture. Olivia Chow, uh, the front runner in that board as well, uh, 1,300 eligible voters were polled on Saturday, on Friday and Saturday, Mitzi Hunter and Mark Saunders in this one sitting tied at 14%, followed by Josh Matlow at 11%, and Anna Bailau and Brad Bradford at 10%. Uh, interestingly enough, not surprising, certainly, Mitzi Hunter, according to that second poll by liaison, uh, garnering much more support uh, in Scarborough as well. That's the, where the vast majority of her supporters are when you look at the regional breakdown, housing, affordability, the two biggest issues in this election. Not a big surprise there, Nick. Okay, Beatrice, appreciate that. Beatrice is in live uh, outside City Hall this morning.